Hello, Sirs Gang. I hope you all are doing wonderful today. My name is Kimati. So, I will be hopping right into y'all energy. I want you all to take what fits, leave what does not. If anything that does resonate, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel. Swat Rose is needed. Also, Sirs Gang, thank you, thank you, thank you for the love, like, comments. Thank you for the support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do to help the channel grow. I really love and appreciate you all. All right, sad. So I'm gonna do one more shuffle here, <clears throat> and we're gonna hop right into the energy for seven carriers. Okay, we got the ten of wands with the six of swords. So I feel like there is a block that is being let down at this time. Somebody feels like they can they can come back in now. <laughs> Somebody feels like they can come back in now, and they can keep everybody out the way. Okay. Now I do feel like you are on some sort of transformation here with the death card. And you are being protected. Maybe you could have let some sort of guard down or block down or wall down. Okay. Um, but you are staying quiet about this transformation that you're making. So so somebody somebody feels like they can come back in, kick everybody out of the way, and it's just you and them. But see, you you plan your cards right or something because you making some sort of transformation or something here. But or you you think that you plan your cards right? Because you're like, all right, I'm gonna let down the guard, but I'm not going to feed into somebody as much. But this can't affect you financially here. Alright, what's this ten of wands in reverse? Yeah, so you feel like you're able to read between the lines. When it comes to somebody who you could have been separated from. Or you felt as though this was not a soulmate. Maybe that was a sort of divorce. You're changing something here. Okay. And with the Six of Swords, you're letting this person come back in. But you know that they wear a mask or something here. You're very intuitive about this person. So you feel like you're playing your cards right. But I don't know. It could really affect you financially, whatever this is. Give me more than six of swords. Yeah, so you letting some back in. You have text, called, message, email someone. Like you've been getting these readings or these messages that this person is still holding on to you or that they are eager to come back in. Okay, so. You feel like, again, you feel like you plan your cards right, like you got everything under control, but I don't know. That's this page of wands. I feel like that could be a car, okay? Maybe there's a car involved. Okay, to where uh, you had a car for this person, you got your own car, you took your car. They happy to come back in because of a car or something. They also been getting signs of synchronicity to this person's neck and start with the B or J. Or they're very eager to come back in to start loving you, to connect things back right with you. What's this page of wands? Yeah, so they don't want to break up. They're, e they're eager to come back in to try to fix things with you. What's the six of wands? Mm. 
I feel like you are going to be keeping your success a secret from this person because it's like, I don't know. It's like, you know that this person is not the best for you, but I don't know. Maybe there's some sort of bond that you guys have or something. You know that this is not faded and you know you got to keep certain things a secret. Also, you know you got to keep third party energy a secret too because they know you will deal with some sort of third party or they feel like it. They ready to cut it the competition the fuck out. What's this death card? What's this death card? Okay, so yeah. So they know that something was ending. Maybe even after a trip or a travel. But they have a, some sort of unfitness business with you. You do too. They could have feared that things was ending after a trip or a travel. They could have feared that you had third party energy in the mix. With this Queen of Wands, they do regret they regret something here with you. They do want to hook up with you. Okay? And they know the truth that you've been hooking up with others. <laughs> this could be a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius here. Okay, sad. So, you got to play your cards smart, not right. You got to play them right smart. Because I feel as though... They might try to come back in being toxic, trying to talk about other people or things that you've been doing when you were not with them. They might be some a bit of aggressive. Okay. Um, what's this high priestess? So, you're getting back with this ex-lover for some of you all. Not all of you all. So, this is for people who are getting back with their ex. People who are getting back with their ex, possibly a musician, someone who you surrendered, okay, maybe you met this person on social media or you've been, um, you could even be some, you, you rolled the dice with somebody here. You rolled the dice with somebody new from social media, you didn't tell this person, you've been trying to keep it a secret and they know what you've been doing the whole time. Okay, what's the five of pentacles? What's this five of pentacles? They feel like you're a snake because you left them out in the cold. You gave up on the family dynamic and you chose to be single. Maybe they feel like you opened the door to have a secret crush or something like this. I don't know, Sat. Okay, maybe you were. You were in the process of healing. Something was greener, but you could have went back to a player or they could feel like you're a player. You could have went back to some sort of relationship that you've already awakened on. Some sort of marriage here that could be financial ties. Maybe y'all could be friends, but it's just like y'all can't be friends sometimes because it's like y'all, it's an anger problem or a temper problem involved. I don't know, Sad. I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. Sad, you're trying to play the cards. You're trying to play your cards, right? But you got to play them good, though, because this is... This is this is a Queen of Swords here, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, somebody who knows the truth about you. Someone who knows the truth about what you've been doing since you've been not talking to them. Or since you cut out some sort of toxic connection with them. And they could get very ag aggressive or abusive. Because they feel like you could have been being a player. They feel like you could have given up the family dynamic to go to something better or to heal. Or to deal with others. So they're going to bring this back up if you do get with them. This is for sides that's going back to their exes, period. But if anything resonates, hit that like button, comment, subscribe to the channel, swap roles if needed, and until next time, bye.